So guys, what is up? It's Teach here coming at you again with hopefully another helpful video over on Arc. Now, basically what I want to show you is an old trick that I use all the time, and it's basically an updated version of it. This is how you get unlimited rock drake eggs. Now, this is literally a never ending strategy. It's super easy to do, and you can come back with it with literally as many as you can carry and or just like create a storage box or something like that and unlimited rock drakes or eggs are yours. So how do you do it? It's pretty simple. You got to go to the following coordinates one right here on your map at 5449. And basically all you're looking for is the actual spire. Now I'll go ahead and show you what that looks like when I get on top of this rock drake here. You see this thing that kind of like goes straight down. Now you're going to go to a specific point in the rock drake section in order to get there. Usually the easiest way to do it is to literally go straight down this thing. Now you can go on each level if you're a little bit more uncomfortable. You don't have to, however, um, you can kind of just like coast your entire way down. Find the skeleton at the bottom where its head point is where you want to end up. See how its head points this way? This is where I want to end up. There's the skeleton, his head points that way. So that's where I want to end up. Again, if you don't mind leaving a like on the video, leave a comment below for the algorithm or if you just have something to say. And again, consider subscribing to the channel if this content is helping you out. That's my only plug. So let's go and continue. So basically, wherever it's head points, you're going to end up going over to a little section right over here. Now, there are going to be a few rock drakes around here. And if you bring yourself access to a and I'm just going to like basically insta kill these things. Um, but basically what you're going to do is you're going to come over here. Nameless will spawn here like you can see. So having a light pet is always a good idea. You don't need one, but it can be quite helpful. So what you're going to do is you're just going to start right here. And this is a little cavern. If you want, I'm just going to make this thing leveled up. So it doesn't matter the level of the rock drake as long as it functions. Basically, you're going to get right here and use this as your point. And you're going to go to the very end of this little cavern. You take your time. You can see all the rock drakes egg eggs off to my left. Those don't matter. You see this egg right here? Yes, this guy right here. This is actually a glitch nest. So what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and go inside of this nest. Let go. Obviously, you can do whatever you want. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Um, it doesn't matter how you get in there, but as long as you know, that's the specific egg nest you're looking for. So this guy right here. Yes, you can see it right here. My rock drake is being a little bit derpy like rock drakes tend to be. And we're going to go ahead and just let go of the walls. So this egg will continually respawn over and over as long as you go back to that one point that we just remembered. Now, all I got to do is hop off, grab the egg and leave the zone. Grab egg, hop on rock drake, leave zone. Now, as soon as I go through this process, I'm going to go ahead and head back, see where I'm going back to this little land bridge right over here you're going to go right back to this exact point. Now, once I go back to this point, you're going to do a quick little turn. This guy realizes you've got one of his eggs, so he's not happy with you. Obviously, this is lower level, so you can get high levels, whatever level server you're on. It's what you're going to get out of it. There's my rock drake egg, right? So again, now that we've been right here for a second, all you have to do is turn back around and head back the exact direction that you came. And in that exact nest will be another rock drake egg waiting for you. Look at that right there. All you have to do is do this on repeat. You can do this 150 times if you want to. It does not matter. You're going to continue to have rock drake eggs spawn here over and over and over again. One of my suggestions in order to get a stupid number of high level rock drake eggs, however, is a little bit different. So you're going to want to kill all the lower level rock drake eggs and you will get basically. OK, really, guys, I'm, I'm trying to make a video here. Be rude. Why don't you? So. You're going to want to kill all the lower level rock drakes. When you kill all the lower level rock drakes, what that's basically going to allow you to do is to claim only the high level rock drakes, because whatever there is a rock drake, the closest rock drake to the nest usually is going to be the one that spawns the egg in. Now, that's important because the one that is nearby is the one that's going to give you the egg. So if you can get a 180 or a 190 nearby or stuck near that nest, it's going to give you the highest number of eggs that are high level. Now, notice how there's a whole bunch of levels in there. You, you usually probably want to bring a gun or something like that and just shoot them. Um, you can kill them with your rock drake if you have the ability with decent rock drakes and you can just go back and forth to the nest. Notice right there. There it is again. And we have the egg just waiting for us. Now, I got a 124 earlier if everything is the same as it was and that closest rock drake is there. It's not. So it's a 12 this time. The closest rock drake was a 12. Now you just go back and forth. And if you really want to, you can go over to this side too and claim these eggs. These do not respawn endlessly. However, these will continue to spawn at a normal rate. The only glitch nest is the one that I just showed you right over there. 
So basically you can just go back to these, grab the eggs because they're just extras, and then move on if you really want to. I'm gonna do it one more time just to show you this is like a never ending thing. You just gotta go back up to this exact point. Basically leaving render range, come on. I usually take this little tree right here, use it as like a little marker, and then go around the back side of the rock. And as soon as I've done that, this guy will spawn back in. So I take my time, fly exactly to where I want to go. Try not to lose distance. It doesn't matter how fast you go. And then by the time you get back over here, it'll be waiting for you. Boop. Just like that. So this is the glitch nest. And a lot of people have used this trick before. You can get some crazy level eggs out of it. There's the 124 again. He is probably the closest and nearby somewhere. But notice how that one egg did not respawn. So it's just the one nest that I have that is the glitch nest. And it's how you get unlimited rock drake eggs. Now you can even use this as a never ending ex, ex uh, what's it called, exceptional kibble farm if you really wanted to, and just get a ton of eggs. As long as you have the weight, you can go back and forth all day and get a ton of exceptional kibble just by playing on this map. Now, again, this is a trick you don't have to use, but it is very helpful if you're using it properly. So hopefully this helps you out and teach out.